Hello everybody, it's Marissa. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be organizing all my hamster supplies and cleaning up and putting it into drawers in my sister's room because for those who don't know this, my plan is to get a hamster and for it to be my emotional support animal when I go off to college. Sorry, my hand's really shaky, guys. Um, so yeah, so when I live here, it will stay in my sister's room and then when I move, it will come live with me. So let's go and organize some stuff. So all my hamster stuff is on the floor in this room. This is my sister's room, it's a very small room. But yeah, I'm gonna be going through it, throwing out things that I don't need. I already started a garbage bin here, um, or a garbage bag here, of all the stuff that I've already started to throw out, which is like my wire wheel, my hamster ball, all the stuff that I realized is bad. I'm also going to be selling this tank on Kijiji because I have an extra bin cage just in case. Um, and I'll be using that cage there and eventually upgrade to an Ikea D12. I just don't live where there's an Ikea, so I'm waiting for that. I'm going to be putting the hamster items on into these drawers here and putting the hamster cage up on this. Okay guys, so I put the cage up on top of the dresser now, and that is what it looks like. I don't know if it's big enough for a hamster yet, I'm still going to measure it, but I do know that I'm getting a D12 cage really soon, so, and probably before I end up getting the hamster, so, yeah. In here, it's kind of messy, but we have a whole bunch of stuff, so we've got the bendy bridges down here, and this little ladder thing, and then we've got this playpen. We've also got a whole bunch of homemade toys. And then here we've got the food and the treats. In the next drawer, we've got some sand baths here, here, and there. And then we have some homemade cardboard shoes and some other toys and food dishes and water bottles. And then over here we have some more homemade toys and some leftover food. Last but not least, we have the shelves, this little cardboard house I made, and all of the stuff to make DIY hamster supplies. So yeah, that's everything I have. Hello guys, so that is pretty much my whole setup upstairs. I did just go to Michael's and I got a few more things. So first I got these little um, clay things. I saw Victoria Rachel do them use them to make homemade treats so I decided that I'm going to use them to make my own homemade treats for hamsters and then I also got this platform that I'm going to put the food and water on and maybe put the wheel on so yeah I'm also making treats right now so I'll show you what they look like sorry the oven's so dirty they're little hearts they're super cute and I'm really excited to use them there you guys go. These are the treats that I made. I'll make sure to link Victoria Rachel's video in the description if you guys want to make your own treats. I made them out of carrot for the orange ones and then cucumber and broccoli for the greener ones. And yeah, they look pretty disgusting, but I'm sure my future hamster will love it. to grab a vinegar and a little scooper thing because those are the last two things I need for a hamster other than the stuff I am getting from Kijiji today. So after I get the Dollarama stuff, I'm also gonna get the 
stuff from Kijiji and I'll show you a picture of the ad. So um, it comes with a whole bunch of stuff and it's $75 and I'm really excited and then I'm going to use the vinegar to clean it. So I will uh, talk to you guys when I get back because I'm not going to vlog there because I'm too awkward. <laughs> Hey guys, I just got back and I got a few things from Dollarama. I got a little a little uh, broom and dustpan for cleaning the cages, a little sifter for cleaning the sand, and I got vinegar that I put in this spray bottle <laughs> to clean the stuff that I just got. And then I showed you guys all the stuff I got and now I'm going to clean it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll make sure to have a part two very soon where I set up the cage. So yeah, see you next video. Bye guys.